welcome to it. This weekend is going to be so fun, so I thought I would take you guys along. I am going all over the place, to be honest, so it's gonna be amazing. Starting off, we are in Bloomington, Indiana right now at Indiana University, visiting my younger sister, Emily, who lives in her sorority house, so I get to live out my dreams and be a sorority girl. Has a house and a room to live in for a night because I was in a sorority in college, but we didn't have houses at the time. And even now they have a house, but it's not like for you to live in, so I never got to actually experience this. So it's really fun. We just went down to the, like the little food area and got food, so that was fun. And then we're gonna sleep in bunk beds. <laughs> it's gonna be great. So we're going to go out to some of the bars here because Emily's 21 now, so she's gonna show me all of her favorite places. And apparently her favorite thing is Thursday night bingo, so it's bingo day. We're gonna go hopefully win and then apparently one of the other bars is having Super Bowl slash Taylor Swift trivia so very excited to see a little bit more about that maybe we can win there she bingo! is bingo and then my other roommate for the night Lucia <laughs> So these are my roommates, guys. <laughs> I'm so excited, guys. Julia hasn't experienced the IU what is Nothing. It, brothers nightlife, um, day life, anything or it's bingo. Awesome. It's an experience. I'm hoping she films there because yeah, you guys will. need to experience it as well. That's why we're. That's why when I said you bring your purse, I was like, okay, so I can bring my vlog camera. Yeah, but yeah we'll see. See how it goes. I'm very excited. Hoping if we do do the trivia that uh, at least maybe Lucia knows a little bit about football because. <laughs> <laughs> Well, hopefully my knowledge of Taylor Swift can carry and cancel out the knowledge that we don't know about football. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll see how it goes. Well, is it like Travis Kelsey? That's what AKA, I'm guessing. Like, yeah. It said Super Bowl X Taylor Swift. Okay. So that's I know a, a little. I've been watching. You can ask me his number and I think that's it. Or about What's his, his number? Brother? 87. <laughs> I was hoping you'd get it wrong. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, I've been watching Jason, all season. Jason I have hope. Kylie, like, <laughs> Come on. That's probably going to be actual football. Yeah, we'll figure okay. it out. Okay. Well, yeah, so that's the plan. I am so excited, but we're going to hang out here a little bit more and then go pick up some of her friends and have ourselves a night. Okay, I forgot. That is part one, so that's tonight. And then at the other nights, I'm going to be visiting other friends, which you guys will see as the vlog continues. So, get excited. <laughs> We made it just in time for trivia at 8, although it said it started at 8 and it's 8.20 and they haven't started yet, so it honestly worked out in our favor. We just made it, we're getting our drinks, and I'm so excited. I'm gonna win, but they have it as a Kahoot, so we'll see how it goes. I have no idea. I don't know. I'm putting it in. Me too. Dang it! How did I <laughs> That's not how they do the Super Bowl. I don't remember the Super Bowl. I don't remember the Super Bowl with me. We're lit. We're lit. Alright guys, we are a few questions in. There's been one question about Taylor Swift so far, and it was how many albums did she have? And we got it right. We got it right immediately. But we have learned that this is not a safe space. I'm gonna play a song. I'm gonna play a song. Immediately. All you gotta do is just dance. Dude, I said the question. The announcer goes, you know what? F Taylor Swift. Not a safe space. Respectfully. And everyone goes, yeah! No. Yeah, not a safe space. Oh, this is 
bar number four. We're going so strong, you guys. Good morning, guys. It's the next day. We are Good walking morning. to Raising Cane. <laughs> 2 p.m. Good morning, 2 p.m. Um, we're going to Raising Cane's for lunch. A very late lunch. <laughs> Okay, so I have showered and refreshed. It's literally like 5 p.m. And I'm just now starting my day. We've been rotting all day because we were all unwell after last night's adventure. But we had a good time. We went to five different bars. Finally, the stamp has mostly gone off my fingers. I got to shower. Emily let me shower in the sorority house, which was fun. Something marked off my bucket list. <laughs> But it's been a good day. We've just been chilling and hanging out and now I'm about to head to my next destination Which is Muncie. That's where I went to college gonna meet up with a few friends and then I'm staying the night with Kylie tonight So I'm so excited to see her. I've already Planned my DoorDash. I'm gonna DoorDash Ninja of Japan. It's like a hibachi I've been thinking of it all day So I'm very excited to get there and order that and yeah, I'm gonna see a few friends I haven't seen in a while and I'm very excited. So let's go. Well, I had a good weekend <laughs> <laughs> Well, I'm leaving Emily's gonna have the rest of her life down here in Bloomington. Mm -hmm. It was fun being a sorority girl for the night. <laughs> okay, I'll go back. <laughs> Safe travels. Thanks, girl. Ow! Oh, pit stop. Same <laughs> day. All right, I made it to their next destination, Kylie's apartment. So we are going to watch a movie. I think we're gonna watch Little Women, the newer one. And we just set up our air mattress, got in my cozy pajamas, and we're ready to just have a little girls' night, so I'm very excited. We've both been reading the Caravelle series together. She's on, actually, I think she just finished the third book, and I'm starting the third book now, so I've actually been listening to them on audiobooks as I'm driving this whole time, because I'm about a two-hour drive in between all these different places I'm going, so that's been nice to be able to read while driving. But yeah, we are excited to have a nice little night. <laughs> Okay, we finished Little Woman. It's one in the morning now, and we really liked it. We've watched so like the updated one, mm -hmm. the newest the newer one. Yeah, it was really good. All the actors are good. We are, at least I am very shocked at the ending, <laughs> but it was good. And the I Love You Joe scene is now going to live forever rent free in my head, I think. It was really good though, highly recommend. I think, what, you rented it on Prime Video? Mm hmm. If anyone ever wants to watch it. But now, I don't know what we're gonna do. We're just having a good time. Girls night. <laughs> Kylie and I went and we just walked around Target. She had a few things she had to grab, so I was like, of course I'll come to Target. I'll never say no to Target. So we got coffee and then went to Target and she just got like fake nails and stuff like that. And I got a puzzle for, for my next stop on this whole tour of every, literally this weekend has been wild. But the next stop is my friend Natalie, who is my big and my sorority. So I just love her. And I'm so excited. She actually lived in Ohio. So I haven't really gone to, actually haven't, I've never gone to visit her in her hometown. I'm so excited. She actually just had knee surgery, so that's why I got a puzzle so that we could just chill and do that. I'm just so excited to have a chill night and get to hang and talk with her. It's gonna be so much fun. So it's about an hour and 40 minutes away of a drive from here in Muncie, so I'm going to make the drive. I need to turn on my audiobook. I actually love it, but I sound like a crazy woman because I pulled in when I was visiting Emily and she's like, what the heck are you listening to? Because it was the audiobook on two times speed. It was so funny. Every story has four parts. Not everyone gets a true ending. Most people give up at the part of the story where things are the worst. <laughs> when the situation feels hopeless, the hope is... So it just sounds so funny. <laughs> so I'm gonna listen to that, see how much I can get through on my drive and just drive. So I'll see you guys when we get there. Guys, I just pulled into Natalie's and look who's greeting me. <laughs> okay guys, I made it to Natalie's. If you guys didn't tell from the goat that was greeting me um, when I first pulled in, that was amazing. She's here. She just had <laughs> surgery, so she's kind of down for the count. But it's, hopefully it'll be much better in the long run. But this is Natalie. If you guys don't know who she is, she was my big and my sorority, our sorority, and it was a good time. So we are here. We started a puzzle, and it was 
We quickly gave up yeah. on said puzzle. Yeah. But <laughs> outside. But not even. We didn't even finish the outline, so we gave up on that for now. Maybe we'll return. I don't know. I think we're going to P.F. Chang's later tonight because her sister works there, so we're going to go visit her. We we're about to watch a movie, and we just got it all set up, so I'm excited. It's so much nicer yeah. when it's not pretty. Hello, friend. What are you today? Hello. <laughs> about to feed the dogs. <laughs> They're so excited. <laughs> oh my god. Hi friends. It's so cute. Hello strawberry. Take tour. Hello. Hello. <laughs> They're so cute. I'll give you pets. Their ears are huge. Aren't they bad? <laughs> Currently getting the farm tour and about to go feed the horse carrot. Tommy. <laughs> oh my god, those teeth! Just let <laughs> She dropped a piece. Get it for her, she's okay. She won't fly. No. Oh, flat hand. Flat hand. What? Julia, do this. <laughs> you do It's that. okay. Well, she's <laughs> having to reach awfully far. Take a step. <laughs> Take a step. She's not gonna eat you. <laughs> I got scared. <laughs> Look at those teeth. Yeah, girl. Hey guys, it is the next day and I am once again in the car driving. Sorry if it's a little shaky. We are heading to our second to last stop of the whole weekend and that is the Stupid Cupid event at the Sixpence, which is the wedding venue that Keegan and I got married at. So I'm so excited to go back and see the place. And I also used to work there for a little bit of time. I work there part time, so I'm very excited to go see all my old co-workers again because I haven't seen them in months now, so I'm so excited. I am literally exhausted though. I am running on empty. I am so tired. I stayed up till 3.30 in the morning that first night with Emily, and then with Kylie the next day, I stayed up till three again. And then with Natalie last night, we stayed up till midnight, and then I stayed up an extra hour until one to edit my video today, because it's Sunday now, and I post videos on Sundays, so I edited it last night and then also woke up early this morning at 7 to finish editing it and getting it ready. So I am so tired. I've had no sleep. I just got a cold brew, went through a drive through and got some coffee. So I'm hoping that can bring me back to life. But I'm so exhausted and now I'm going to a social event where I have to mingle and talk to people. So I'm just hoping I can get some energy back before then so I'm not like not fun to be around. So we'll see how it goes. I'm so excited. I get to see Kylie. And it's going to be so cute. Last year, Kylie and I went to this event and it was just so pretty. They really go all out, so I'm very excited. We're going to meet some other influencers in Indiana, so that'll be fun. But yeah, I'm very excited to take you guys along. I know, I think there's going to be some like finger foods and drinks. I'm obviously, I don't even know if I'll even drink any. I'm like over alcohol ever since Thursday night. That was so rough. <laughs> but I was hungover all day Friday. Probably not going to have a drink, especially because I have to drive. But like two hours back home afterwards, but it'll be cute. Maybe I'll get one for some pictures. When I went through the drive-thru, the worker was like, oh my gosh, you look so beautiful. I was like, thank you so much. That is so sweet. That was so nice and definitely started my day off on the right foot. So I am just excited and ready to get to this event. I'm getting there like 20 minutes late though. And then I have a few things I need to do before I can go in. Like I need to make my thumbnail for my video because it's gonna probably post while I'm there. I need to check because my little sister was house sitting for me last night but I'm not sure if she armed the house back up when she left this morning, so I'm gonna try and do that from my phone. So, we'll see how it goes. But I am about 20 minutes away now, getting excited, and I will see you guys when we go in there. Okay, I'm here, I made it. I just got all ready, finishing touches, and I'm about to walk in, and I'm so excited! Put all your stuff away and check out for the day. There's no time to waste when it's 100 degrees Burns under my feet Won't you have a drink with me? We, we okay, I'm here. This is Hannah, you guys. Hi. Is it Indiana underscore Hannah? Indiana Hannah underscore Okay, there you guys go. We're having a great time. We think we're about to go try on dresses. Let's see how it goes. Okay, hello, 
Okay guys, I made it to the last stop of this crazy weekend and I am so exhausted. So tired. I stopped at my parents' house and I made puppy chow because I ran out of peanut butter. So I did that and then now I'm here at my brother and sister-in-law's house. So it's Keegan's brothers and we are going to watch the Super Bowl because it's Super Bowl Sunday. So I have my puppy chow to bring. I'm about to go in and hopefully have a really good dinner and hang out with my family. So I'm very excited. It's gonna be good. So let's do this. Oh yeah, and also eventually Keegan is probably gonna get back in like five hours and I have to go pick him up from his friend's house who was on the bachelor trip. It's actually the bachelor himself. So eventually we'll go pick him up too. We are back home. Super Bowl's over. Look who's home. Keegan. <laughs> we, I, the Super Bowl, obviously, most of you guys probably don't. Went in overtime. So we are so tired. We went and got Taco Bell afterwards. So it's 11.45 p.m. And we are finally home. Back with the dogs. All night, I wore this shirt because it's Taylor Swift and I obviously, I don't have any Chiefs gear. I really don't care about any NFL teams. So I just wore this. And I, all night, I was teasing my nephew who is a very big Chiefs fan, I guess about my favorite player being Taylor Swift and I'm wearing her jersey and he's like, what? No, she's not a player. And it was really funny. But I am so tired and so is Keegan because he just got back from a crazy long bachelor trip. Said it was great, so that's a good. But that's where I'm gonna end this vlog because I'm exhausted. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.